What's good? We're here back in Technology Tree Zone. So this has got more of a dubby step zone, you know, kind of thing. Um, big loop right there. Holy crap. Big, big loop. Um, so far, the sights here are really cool and reminds me a lot. There's a lot of areas in this game that really remind me of Chemical Plant. I'm not going to lie. Um, uh, but either way, I digress. Um, it's, uh, definitely sounds like a technology tree. Kind of a, like, you, you know how, like, um, some, some, some soundtracks be sounding like they farting, bruh? This soundtrack sounds like it be farting, I'm not gonna lie. Like, they know I be fire. Can't, I can't let the hose know that I be farting, you know what I'm saying? Like, ooh! Look at that. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of good at this game, guys. I, I, I don't, I don't, uh, um, I don't mean to brag, um, especially when, you know, the ladies are watching, but, um, kind of cracked at this game, not gonna lie. Um, like, you see this right now? Hit him over the spiky wikies. One, two. Okay. That gimmick right there is a little weird, but I'm a, uh, I'll figure it out. Oh my gosh, the little rabbit guys, bro. Okay, run, 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 run down. Okay, nice. They, 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 they thought they'd get me, but no. Oh well, they got me that time. You know what? Fair. Nice. Ooh, jump over. So far, I, I really like the scenery in this area, and um, this is a little uh, blind now because um, I haven't actually been all the way through this zone. What the frick was that? Oh my gosh! Whoa! Okay, I didn't even do that. Something made me like do that that dash but um okay i will say as good as this music is um yeah i'll say this is one of the weaker uh soundtrack ones uh or weaker on the ost but it's not bad um it definitely fits with the area i could say that um okay my drop dash wasn't coming out earlier what the f what are these things bro why are they making sonic get hurt like okay we're gonna have to figure this out Ooh, hold up i know what to do no all right nice okay there we go yeah it does definitely seem that like lake uh kind of i guess in a way took the suggestions of the people i guess I guess in the way of like, oh, you know, a lot of people didn't really like the level design of before the sequel, which, to be fair, I didn't either. So it seems like he really took that advice and was like, all right, you know, let me fix that. Um, anyway, we got through Act 1, and I'm ready to hear the music. I think from here, it's completely blind. I haven't seen, like, really anything on this game since. So... All I hear right now is that the music is great. Um, no, I'll let y'all listen for the. Oh wait, those speed up things from uh, um, Carnival Night Zone. Oh, that reminds me. So, low key, guys, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. It might just be because I grew up with the internet, so like I kind of already knew about. Um, I kind of already knew about the, uh, you know, the barrels of doom as they call them. But low key, I freaking, I freaking love. Carnival Night Zone. I think it's the only like casino-esque stage that I like, and it's probably because it doesn't have pinball. And I swear, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put it out there, guys. Um, if there's even a single pinball stage in this game, uh, zero out of ten. Just just gonna put that out of there. But um, nice. All right, cool. I love using a controller because um, uh, I just feel like my movements were more precise. Um, and I think that's another reason I didn't really enjoy before the sequel all too much because I just, I, I didn't, I, I didn't, my movements didn't feel precise because I didn't have a controller, you know, to aid me. Um, whereas here it's like, oh, I can, you know, if I need to pull back, I can pull back. If I need to go forward, I can go forward. I just like having a controller in classic games because it just, it feels more precise to me. Uh, jump, 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 jump. Ooh. That was close. All right, nice. 
these guys from freaking, uh, what are they, Sonic 1? Um... Okay, yeah, those guys were getting me. Alright, that was, that was just blatantly unfair. <laughs> Alright, I'll let y'all see this running animation. Yes, sir! Um, but I, what is that? Is that Zerg, bro? What the frick? <laughs> what the frick? Hey, yo! Hey, yo! Oh, yo! Hold on, Zerg? This thing is following me. Chill. Oh my, chill. Um. Oh my gosh, I thought that was gonna get me, I'm not gonna lie. I was like, no! Nice. Give me that. Um. But yeah, I, I, um, I actually like Carnival Night Zone, and I don't think Sandopolis is, like, incredibly bad. I think it's just because I like, um, stage exploration. Like, I, I don't mind if Sonic goes incredibly fast unless it's, like, a modern Sonic game, which I like modern Sonic games. But it's like, I also, oh, okay, there we go, we destroyed it now. But I also don't, you know, mind taking my time and exploring, and, I, and that's how I mainly like to play my classic games, which is... Just casually, you know, running through, and I think speed is rewarded in that area. And I think that's what I like more about the classic games is just being able to do like a casual, you know, just r hold on, hold. Nah, let me shut up. Let me shut up, because that's beautiful. I funk fiction. You are a god. Oh my dude. That was so good. Oh my like I might cry. I might cry. Like that that's that's beautiful, elegant, bro. Oh my gosh. But I I I don't even remember or even care about what I was saying before. I think I was saying something about, like, Sonic 3, Sandopolis, or, or, oh, yeah, I like to casually play through, uh, classic Sonic games like this, because I feel like you're more rewarded for that way, playing for score and just however many rings you want, like, I just like to kill, like, me, personally, like, y'all probably already noticed it, I like to get as many rings as I can, and I like to, um, uh, and I like to kill a lot of enemies, and I like to just kind of explore, take my time. I don't want to get through everything really quickly, but in turn, that makes me get through these zones quicker because I have more, like, precise platforming because of that, and it's like, I purposely slow myself down a lot, especially in these platforming sections where it's like, I've never played this game, I'm very unfamiliar with it in some aspects, so, um, so it's like, I have to slow down, but because I've had so much practice with, like, you know, actual, like, 
classic Sonic games, like, you know, I have more precise platforming here, which is why I think I'm just doing so good in these platforming sections. It's like, I, I've, you know, I've done this for a good amount of years, probably since I was like 16. Um, even though, you know, I never grew up in the classic era. Oh, let me destroy the frick out of you, bro. Get out of here. Finally. Jeez. God, this music is phenomenal, dude. There we go. I think you have to go under those. I'm not too sure what the gimmick is there, but I'm assuming you have to go under those. There we go. Nice. Act three. I have no idea what the boss could be. Like, like I said, this is all blind from here on. Okay. I see, I see. Oh no. Freaking floor launch stuff. I love how Eggman is just like in these little like mech things. <laughs> kind of looks like he's in like a, a so, like a baby, <laughs> a baby like high chair support or something like that. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh. Oh, uh oh. I not uh oh do i have to make him get hit with his own weight oh that's cool he's like wait nice yeah you ain't getting out of here egg man oh that one was easy honestly i kind of made that out to be a little harder than it needed to be Oh! I'm flying! I've ascended into Hedgehog Goddom. Alright, let's see what we got. Moon Mansion Zone. Okay. I have no... This is interesting. Like I said, after this point, I haven't seen anything on this game. So, I'm really curious to kind of see what's going on here. Uh, I kind of wish it was October now that I'm playing this. But, you know, it is what it is. We do what we do. What we do. Um, okay. Let's see. Okay. I like that guitar so far. Okay. that wow okay oh I like those uh, bad nicks they look really cool okay ah so like an elevator no that's an Eggman monitor <laughs> dang it I didn't realize what it was. I thought it was speed shoes at first, and then I realized too late. That one was my fault. I won't even lie. Oh, I see. So those guys have like a, a set like, oh, so when they're, you can only go through those guys. These are really creative badnik ideas. I kind of feel like I'm in a haunted mansion from uh, Sonic Heroes. I hope I didn't just, okay, good. <laughs> I was like, I hope I didn't just freaking screw myself over. Nice fire shield, give me that. Gonna need that. Hit up here. I already know that can hurt you. The fact is going. Thank you for that. <laughs> I like the music too. The music's nice. Um. 
And then wasn't there, there's another zone that people don't like that I kind of like. Oh, it was Marble Zone. Okay, so Marble Zone from Sonic 1. Low-key, like, I get why people don't like it. Like, I'm not saying that I don't get why people don't like it. But me personally, I think Marble Zone's pretty cool. Like, especially when you kind of, like, master Marble Zone. I think, I think that's when it's really cool. And Marble Zone, when you master it, feels quick. It feels fast. Like, I feel like I can, you know... I feel like I can go really quick in Marble Zone. It's, did I just kill him? No, I think I just got rings. That's it. Okay. Gotta be careful with these bad nicks. I'm trying to keep all my rings. Oh, please. Um. Oh, he got... Okay, he got me. That was fair. Um. But I feel like Marble Zone, like... Like me, I feel like I'm one of the only people that really like. I hate Labyrinth Zone as much as the next person. Like I, I, I hate Labyrinth Zone. It sucks. But I actually, I, like, like I said, I, I really like Marble Zone, and I think it's just because when you kind of master it, it doesn't feel slow or sluggish. It feels, it feels fine. Like it feels good to play. Like especially if you know how to play it efficiently and really good, you can get through it like really quick. Like you can make your platforming more precise and. Uh, quicker and it makes uh it makes for a a better more fun experience i think um uh but you know that being said like you know it, it, it's not everybody's cup of tea and i understand that but personally i i like it i don't know why i do but i do like i always i always love uh jumping across the the platforms that turn on fire when you press on them i love just going over those like real quick um and if you like if you really really master marble zone it doesn't feel as slow and sluggish as people say which don't get me wrong i get why people say it i'm not saying that they're wrong for saying that in fact you know completely valid i used to think the same thing but like if you master it it's it's really not as bad as i think people make it out to be anyway hold on i i i'm kind of like conflicted because this music is good but like i'm not like too big like I, I don't dislike spooky uh games or anything like that but i'm not like too big on like spooky themes and whatnot like that like i don't know to me it's just kind of a cliche but like this is okay i'll let y'all have a listen because let me i think i'm getting it i think i can get into this hold on found the guitar who found the guitar holy crap I know what to do oh my gosh that guitar was awesome I'm liking the aesthetic here for sure the aesthetic here looks really freaking good um I, I kind of wish I got on top of that but I guess there's a spring down here no there's just a bottom route like a bum but I like the aesthetic here for sure. Like these blues are really nice. Um, do you want to? Okay, yeah, I was about to say. Do you want to like screw the frick off? <laughs> okay, I see the vision. Like I see the vision here. I love the level aesthetics for sure, and the music. Like I said, music. It's been a one. The level design has definitely improved. Um, it's it's far better than before the sequel. But do I think it's better than other fan games and still a little outdated? I can I can see it. But I actually haven't had too much of a tough time. I think instead of actually making level design, though, I feel like... Because, like, there's still a lot of enemies here. Like, you can see, like, he, he does have this, like... He still has the idea of harsh enemy placement everywhere. Um, other than that, like... And, like, you know, lots of spike spam here, you know, like... So, it's, like, it's still easier to navigate. So, I think he made it an easier time. But I don't think that, like blatantly excuses kind of like what i can see which is like there's still a lot of enemies in the stage there's still a lot of spike assets fam a lot of those uh, stupid double spring things from freaking sonic cd that i freaking absolutely despise so it's like there's still a lot of things that like he could change but i still feel like he made it more 
to the liking of, okay, it's a, there's water here, okay, um, he made it more to the liking of, oh, it's just easier now, it's not, it's not like anything to, like, that'll screw you over all the time like it did with, uh, before, are, are we getting a bubble or not? You know what? Screw you. Yeah, there we go. Give me that bubble. Because they didn't want to daggum give me the... I... Okay, so do I not lose a bubble underwater? That's actually good, if that's the case. Is it kind of like the first game? Okay, hold on. Ah! Ah! That's annoying. Like, there's no way you can avoid that. There's no way you can avoid that. They just expect you to, but you can't. All right, that's Act Two. Now I'm curious for Act Three. That was that was cool. That was cool. I like that. But we're gonna see what Act. Okay, hold on. Oh, yo, you from freaking uh. It's you! I don't need you to come back. Honestly, I prefer you not. Oh my gosh, this music though. I'd prefer if you don't come back. Uh, you're pretty easy this time around compared to how I, when I had to fight you in, uh, before this, okay, there we go. Now we're moving. Okay, cool. Oh! Really loving the aesthetic for sure. The aesthetic is great. I do like Spooky Stage's like aesthetic for sure. Um, like those to me are just like super freaking cool. Um, there we go. Got you. Go ahead and grab these rings. Oh, uh, might as well go ahead and grab that. But wow, y'all know I have to do that every single time, right? I hope y'all know that. Oh my, that would have screwed me. God! I like how it kind of has the uh, do 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 uh, theme from uh, the before the sequel theme. Like, mixed into it. That God, this is really freaking good. Hold on. And I wasn't hating on the OST before, but holy crap. Like, it just stepped up. Oh my gosh, this kind of... I thought there was a, a raise-up spike there, I'm not gonna lie. Um, this gets me hyped for the rest of the freaking game. Oh, can't see you. Little lightning bug, eh? Like the lightning bug uh, gimmick from... Uh, um, or mini boss from uh, Mania. This guy wants me dead. Honestly, maybe I should have played this Sage's Tales, but you know what? I like Sonic better, so screw Tales. Frick that guy. Yeah. <laughs> Go. Okay, I got lighter again. Nice. Like I said, so far, like, God, A1, bro. Really awesome. Like, this music gets you pumped up, like, lets you, makes you want to play. Like, geez, like, and the level design isn't the horrible, like I said, it, it's pretty good. Now I'm curious to see Moon Mansion boss. Of course it's you. What? Whoa! Oh, I'm, I'm kind of curious as to what the cutscene's gonna be leading up to this. Uh, um. 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 Hello? Hello? 
Okay, it saved it the boss. We're good to go. Alright. I see. Alright, I kind of... I see the vision. Oh, I was going to say I need to get under that. Okay, grab that. Okay, that one won't hurt me. Nice. It seems like he controls weather. Nice. Alright, just wait for him under here. Jeez, he takes so many hits. There we go. Dude, this game is so broken. Anyway, I think next... I think next we'll be tackling Red Hot. This zone looks so freaking cool. Red Hot Ride Zone. Anyway, if you guys did like this video, please make sure to hit that like button as it does help it a lot and lets me know that you guys are liking what I'm putting out. Because y'all seem to be, y'all really seem to enjoy before the sequel and I would hope that by the time this comes out, y'all have been enjoying after the sequel um, as much as I have. I've actually really, 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 really been enjoying this and uh, I'm looking forward to the end uh, for sure. As well as, um, hey, uh, if you're new around here, consider hitting the subscribe button or smashing that subscribe button or hit the subscribe button, whatever the heck the terminology is to make that thing glow. I don't know what it is or how it works. Um, it probably doesn't work because I'm a loser and I don't have over a million subs. Anyway, um, <laughs> uh, do it. Uh, because I do a lot of Sonic content right now, at least. So if you like Sonic, uh, you're covered on that. But if you like other stuff, I do other stuff too. Um, just not as frequently right now, but we're going to get to it. Um, and yeah, I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.